authorities are scaling back, but continuing their search for a missing boater in Mobile Bay near Fort Morgan. A shrimp boat with three on board capsized around four this morning. The captain survived, rescued by another boat. The body of a crew member, though, was recovered around one this afternoon. News 5's Brianna Hollis has more now from Fort Morgan. Search and rescue teams spent the entire day launching from these docks looking for those crew members. Dive teams scouring the Mobile Bay after a shrimp boat capsizes. This is a picture of that boat. It's named the Chief. It docks out of Billy Seafood in Bon Secure. Now it's destroyed. There was a shrimp boat that was overturned in Mobile Bay. Uh, about a mile and a half north of uh, Fort Morgan here. Aliyah Marine Patrol says the captain, Woody Jones, survived. Billy Parks, the owner of Billy Seafood, says he buys shrimp from Jones and the two of them are friends. He tells News 5 Jones's son in law, who was on another shrimp boat last night, was the first to discover something was wrong. He got to looking and looking, he couldn't see him, so he looked on the radar, he couldn't see him. He goes and starts. Uh, following the diesel fuel skim on the water. So the captain uh, was actually floating on an ice chest and he was recovered by some other shrimp boats that were in the area. Bring Woody in and, and put him in the ambulance here at my dock. And he was uh, pretty uh, banged up. Park says Captain Jones was in the water for about two hours before his son-in-law found him. The search, a widespread effort. Crews from the Coast Guard, Alia Marine Patrol, Fort Morgan, and Bon Secure Volunteer Fire Departments, Daphne Search and Rescue, and Orange Beach Fire Rescue participated. Reporting in Fort Morgan, Brianna Hollis, WKRG News 5.